Hey, this is Dave with ExploreNet.com, and tonight we're hanging out at Epcot for the 10 millionth time. <laughs> but it's totally cool, I love being here. This is one of my favorite places to be, and I will continue to keep coming down here throughout the entire festival. But tonight is Joy for Time. Five, four, three, two, one. Shades off. Heading into the awesome brewing at the Odyssey Pavilion, and it's interesting because this used to have the Disney experience, the Epcot experience that was in here. But instead, now there's a live DJ spinning like almost every day so that all the people that have kids can come in here, relax, and have their kids be entertained for a little bit. Now, if you're a fan of the channel, you'll understand that I did have a Play Pavilion update video. You can catch that card right here. But in my opinion, a space like that would be a cool Play Pavilion. Or if they moved it back over to where the NBA experience was over at Disney Springs, I thought that would be awesome as well. The popcorn buckets are still here. They're the Skyliner version, the yellow Skyliner version. Uh, you'll never get me on that thing again, but I did film that with little guy, and you can catch that right here on that card. But the good news is that they did keep bird feeders. Uh, usually when they have new festivals like this, they change stuff out. This stayed here, birds are well fed. <laughs> That's for the birds, I guess, I don't know. The empty Starbucks building is still empty over here. I wonder what that'll turn into now that the Connections Cafe is open back up that way. <laughs> if you want to check that video out, you can take a look at that card right there. Um, we're getting into fall and getting into cool stuff like Halloween. We're getting into cool stuff like Thanksgiving. We're getting into cool stuff like Christmas and football season too. Let's head on over to our virtual queue entrance. All right, so the bright side of being stuck in the line queue on this ride is that it is one of the best line queues in the entire history of theme park design. I don't want to ruin anything for anybody. I don't want to spoil anything for anybody. So I'm just going to let you all know that there's a card right here that you can click on so you can see what all the line queue stuff looks like if you missed out on Guardians of the Galaxy the first time. But this whole place in here has such a great atmosphere. Sometimes you can even catch Peter Quill dancing on a flashlight. I wonder if I can use that footage right there and, and run up behind little guy. Definitely an awesome film production going on behind me. That being said, I'm super excited to announce my new cinema pieces, which are coming. One of them will be a TV show. And I can't wait to share them with you when they are complete. Music fans, it's time. Put your hands together and welcome to the stage. Joey Fatone and friends. Give it up for the greatest boy band of all time right here. This one. Easily. I'm just saying. We got a party like we're 21. We have fun. So I said a whole long spiel and this guy's been a very good friend of mine. I love him. Please give a round of applause for James S. Murray. it has been. The international students and the international employees, a lot of cast members, a lot of people are back here at Disney, here at Epcot, and things have kind of returned to a little bit normal. Thank you for watching. I can't wait to go on another adventure with you.